hello and welcome to my channel if you're new and if you like you want to subscribe click on the subscribe button and you can join me on my journey around different golf clubs testing things out when I get the chance to and also if I'm lucky on my bike see if anything happens on the road right so today we're down at Martin Golf Club because uh, they've got great facilities for practicing in and the weather's not brilliant so if it does start raining we do have the option of going inside We've got nice little huts here which I can uh, which I can practice in. So what I've acquired to test out, which I think could be an excellent idea um, for winter golf, when you're practicing during the winter, or even in the summer if you wanted to try it, is the AquaStrike mat. I believe it's got PGA approval or awards, which helps you tell you how you're hitting the ball without having to go to a lesson or using a track man or anything else that uh, you'd have to pay for. So this one, we've just stuck it down on the grass, it's got four pegs in it and it goes the golf course, in your back garden, if you want to use airtight balls so you can practice at home. It just goes anywhere. You could probably use this one at the range, this is the outdoor version that I've got, uh, but you can buy an indoor version which you can use at the range. Um, so yeah, so you just stick it on the floor, stick some pegs in it, like this. Now as you can see, I've already hit a ball. So all you do, if I can get this on there, you see that it's marked there, all you do is wipe back and start again. So you get instant feedback to where you're hitting it, whether you're hitting it straight, left, right, you're hitting the ball or you're hitting before the ball. So I think in theory you should be hitting the ball first and taking your divot, if I'm correct. I think I am. So we're going to play around with it, going to see what we'll think of it. Uh, I also have acquired a 10% discount if uh, you want to buy one. I'll put a code in the description as well uh, and you'll get 10% off. So we're going to hit a few balls and see how we do. I also think you could probably use um, your driver on it in the winter mats because all you'd need is your plastic, is your winter tees. And then you can find out that where you're hitting the ball. Or if you're hitting on your driver and you're hitting the ground first, you can, you can probably see it. I believe there is a driver version coming out. I'm not too sure how that's going to work. Um, but we'll uh, we'll see in the future. Right, so we're going to hit a few balls. We're going to get some instant feedback to where I'm hitting it and how bad I am. Right, as you can see, on there, I've hit. there which is well behind the ball and I've gone slightly to the left so that gives you instant feedback so but we'll wipe it clear it's not very easy to do this with a, a camera like this As you can see, I'm hitting the ball 
well before is in the ground well before and it's going slightly off to the left so let's see if we can improve on that Again, slightly before. <clears throat> Let's try it with an airtight ball, see what that does. Well, that one, I hit right. And it went quite straight, as you can see. So I hit just after the ball, and it's gone quite straight. So you do get instant feedback. Hey guys, so I've just moved on to the uh, ninth hole. Here yeah, he's going to be coming. I'm going to give a couple of shots now with a hybrid on the mat, and a couple of shots with a seven iron. So we're actually doing a proper, if you're out on the course, simulation sort of thing. So uh, bear with me and I'll set you up. Hey right, guys, I'm gonna go, oh, yeah. right, we're gonna go with the hybrid first. Oh, there's nobody at the tape, which we're all right, so we're gonna go with the hybrid. That wasn't a bad shot. That wasn't a bad shot that, but as you can see, I've hit the ground, or hit the mat here, and the ball's gone sort of right, sort of centre-ish, but not fully. So we'll hit another one with a hybrid and see if we can do any better. Sure, you definitely need clean clubs. Right, that one, as you can see, I've hit just past the ball. As you can see, I'm going to minute. I've hit just past the ball. It's gone off to the left. So we'll try one more. And you can't see the map there. Come back a bit, there we go. This one, as you can see, it's come off the heel and it's gone sort of straightish, but not. So it's not gone very far, it's been duffed. So we've got one more.
So that one was a clean strike, duffed it, that's because I'm thinking about it, and uh, it's gone sort of straight-ish. So yeah, ideal mat to use in the winter. Uh, I'll just check if there's nobody on the tee. And uh, probably the best train aid on the market, I'd have thought. Because you get an instant feedback. And you're not paying £25, £50 pound to go and see a golf pro to see what you're doing wrong. Obviously, if you need to correct it, you may have to go see a golf pro. But, you can work on your own swing, know what you're doing, and it's going to change things. So yeah, so give it a go. And uh, comment below, tell me what you think. Cheers guys.